Smart contracts aren't based on a person deciding the solvency of their enterprise. They're based on mathematics and physics enforcing things like solvency, enforcing things like collateral. And so when you look at um, the nature of contracts, their reliability is one of their primary properties. And so the, the agreements and the systems that create a reliable system of contracts are actually the systems that win and they're the systems where everybody, want, everybody wants to conduct commerce. So that's, I think, one of the reasons you actually such a, see such a difference between emerging markets and develop, more developed markets in that in developed markets, you have a system of contract that contracts that works and people can conduct commerce and people are comfortable purchasing from those markets and making contractual relationships within those markets and you know, between the, their market and an external one. And I think what's, what's, what's going to happen is that that playing field of reliable agreement is gonna be leveled by smart contracts, both on a domestic level and an international level. 